déjà vu. Pas tout de <laughs> I might send this to Jules. One day, Shane and I might experience a nice, stress free trip to the fucking airport. Unfortunately, it wasn't this time. <laughs> Man like JJ, no Esther visa, literally the same thing what happened to me. I had the feeling this time it was going to come through. Shane literally said, oh. this gave me goosebumps. He goes, I keep checking my Apple Watch to see a text from Jay saying that it's come through. The second he said that, it came through on my Apple <laughs> yeah, Watch bit, saying, like, get me a beer, lad, I've got it. <laughs> Do you know what scared me, though? When we were doing it on the machine, we didn't get this on video, but we were doing it on the machine, and then it came up, and the woman was like, who's Terrence? <laughs> so, and she was like, you haven't got an Esther visa, and I'm like, I just have that. Yeah. <laughs> I know a lot of your viewers are from America. It's a third world country. <laughs> we just lost followers for that. <laughs> Couple of clicks off there. Yeah, America, yeah. that was the camera guy, not me. GoPro, if you're watching this, I want sponsorship. Final call, will Darug Murray please come to the desk? Oi, rumour has it, Slappy's driving that. <laughs> it's not TV switch. No, didn't they say in some cabins? That's it all. It's a long flight without a TV. Have a safe flight, Mr. Wilson. Thank you, Mr. Jones. <laughs> Have yeah. a show, show YouTube, little Tommy Shelby up there. It's fresh, that. Yeah. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That's not a Tommy Shelby, that, is it? No, no, I don't go, don't go skiing anymore. Yeah, yeah. Just go zero. I went skiing, you know. Getting old now, can't be do you know, skiing. Do you know why I went skiing? Yeah, I but went... you got low, I got mid. Do you know why I went skiing though? Because I can't be asked going to get a cut all the time. So if you go skiing, he spies you a bit more time. Get an extra week. Yeah, get an extra week. <laughs> this is going to be a slog, boys. We've got no screen for 16 hours. Nah, that's going to be. My head's gone already, by the way. My head's rolled. That's going to be bad, though. Nervous. five-year-old sausage that's been sat there for about six years and uh, Slappy's cricket pads that he keeps in his car every week in the shag wagon look at that so bad hey uh, can I order um, baby pants for a week <laughs> what do you say to that brekkie for oh, I was 10 out of 10 though. I had one look at that and then I was like <laughs> That sausage there, it's miserable that sausage isn't it? <laughs> Looks like he's been on a 14 hour flight like us, that sausage. <laughs> one. I forgot that they asked that one. Don't we mess around here? We were well over weren't we with our bags? Mate you're getting, you're getting nothing, you put your f***ing undies in and they're full. I don't know, I was getting separate and then proper normal <laughs> Nigel there was again. <laughs> what did he do? What did he do? I just, there was like two I could have got, I got, there was a girl and then the fella was like proper quizzing everybody. But then I got the girl so it was fine. The lad was asking like what he had for breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> hey, can I have a large cappuccino please? What? Cappuccino, add to cart. I've got a seat. No. <laughs> Don't spill it. So you probably got to drink a tutor through the window. <laughs> Excuse me, mate. <laughs> oh. 
Oh, you tell me that it's not open. Do you push that? Tap to pick Tap up. Tap to pick up. Oh, there we go, Shane. Lovely, so. <laughs> Cheers, Jeff. So that was a long wait. That was a long Insta story, that. Wow. Oh wow, it's actually good. No banner. Oh. It's not a <coughs> good coffee. That's what I eat that. For America, that's a good coffee. For America, I'm from a fucking <coughs> robot. Long day. Toronto, are we here, baby? Oh, what car do you reckon we're gonna get? Probably the Camry. Tesla, I think. We've gone two ends of the spectrum. What do you mean? Well, I've said Camry, <laughs> you've said Tesla. Look at that, it's Rolls. What is it, Shane? Rolls. Rolls. Hold it, there we go. Airbrush. <laughs> got the fringe on there, please. <laughs> <laughs> this is the f tune of the trip at the minute. <laughs> this is a f tune. <laughs> I like it that way. They want me back on soul, choosing chips, they'll rash and a pat me both. Small fuck, tall boy. Fucking tall boy. Yeah, hurt boy. Wow, boys. I can't get over the snow, can you? Okay, yeah. Oh, fuck, that's fresh, that. Oh. Son of a boy! Gosh! I'm fucking. I'm free. Do you want to say, Too warm outside. It's rest on this. What a long day, man. That was. That's one. That's one of the longest flights I've ever took in terms of like. In terms of just packing about. So my first thoughts on Canada: cold, snow, rated. Yeah. Highly. <laughs> but, oh, and the heated seats in the car. I, I a joke. I don't think that's strictly a Canada thing, though. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We haven't had a stop, really. Oh, no. I'm starving. Starving. I'm gonna send it with a Macca's thing. That's it, thanks. Do do? Welcome, you can drive. Do 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 do. Hold on. <laughs> Need a <Ooh. laughs> Me McDonald's has gone clean through. I'll be with you in a bit. You <laughs> seven combos. Come yeah. on. <laughs> <laughs> me, me number seven deluxe is coming clean up. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Fancy seeing you here. Come on in, MTV Cribs. <laughs> so we've got the vlog that's um, exporting there. We've got a coffee machine, a toaster that's not even plugged in. Which we'll sort that out. Lots of food for tonight. Lots <laughs> <laughs> of food. But the view is, is will be. Shane, Shane's bed in Scratcher. We've just got Toronto, Canada there. Wow, we've got boys. got Randy in the back. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! That is sick. Right, I actually do want to go on two foot of snow and go Instagram live. Win your battles! Fucking <laughs> tackle! Day one. Day one. This is the start. Day one, we've snowed in. We can't get out. <laughs> well, it's froze, is it? No, is it? Yeah, yeah. Better get the car on then, live. What do you do for wireless? 
No, you have to put the heaters on. Now, oh, what's the other side of that for? This guy's got a better brush. Look yeah. at the state of our brush. What do you do with that? Is it scrape the ice, is it? Oh, yeah. So, one side's for the, yeah. yeah one yeah. side, then you get the snow off, and then you get the, uh, yeah. Ah, oh. oh, thank you. Yeah, I missed the dinner since we left. <laughs> JJ. He's breaking his PEV tonight. I'll let you guys try and work that one out. Right, we're here, boys. Keep keep your eyes peeled. Oh, there it is, that's Shit. Oh, wow. There it is. It's all my dreams, but Reserve for Lee Jones and Jones and the fucking boys. Yes, guys, we're here at Mr. Sauger Stadium. It honestly feels like, I don't know, months we've been waiting for this moment, just Yeah. So yeah, we're buzzing, JJ in the background. He's gonna get a trim by uh, Mr. Jeffrey tonight. <laughs> we just found a Panda Express as well for dinner tonight. Did, to be fair, we didn't sleep very well, did we? Nah. We all proper struggled to get to sleep last night. Jet lag was getting us. Mm. But we're here, we're ready to go. Got a stab, Let's go and meet the game awareness, boys. Let's see what uh, see what it's all, all about, this dome. This is what you need in Sydney. Imagine this is uh, Sydney. This is the dream. This is what we Imagine need, this then. is a Jonah complex. Oh, this is what I want. Exactly this, please. That is the dream, isn't it? Hey, hey, hey. 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 It was okay, yeah. We came uh, yesterday at 12 at night. Shit, yeah, yeah. I am feeling it. Here it is. Hey, right, I need to look at you two and see the difference. Oh, I really know what's going on. This is a shame. Oh, hey, friend. Hi. Oh, it'd be difficult delivery from that point, Fagwin. I'll say you put In swing up, in swing up. For the that cost. That's insane. They're lovely. Yeah, that's. That is class, that, to be fair. I want to take one of these back. Definitely want to take. I want to take one of these back. I do. Frame it for sure. Oh, man. Think quick, play quicker. Yeah. Right, that. That's our motto. <laughs> bop, 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 bop. <laughs> okay. But we need to get in this meeting room and show you what we're going to be yeah, doing sure. throughout the week yeah, and stuff like that. So we turn over with them getting yeah. off all the time and us getting on because we're going to be like that all week. Oh, there's all the equipment in that little room we're just in. Yeah. Comb, yeah. Combs, yeah. And they have a lot of cones. They have like the, the small cones and the big ones. Yeah. Big ones. Beautiful. Pass comes in, they press, and we've just got two gates. Like it. it's yeah, it's like a it's a one we want, but a lot of emphasis on first touch and skills like that. Like that. How's the morning? What's going on? Good to meet you. Oh, hey, friend. This is uh, this is Shane. Oh, friend. Excuse me. Have we got a speaker? <laughs> you want me to try it? It's not going to blow the roof off, huh? I can't blow the roof off. Blow the roof off. Jesus Christ! Is that loud? It's just burst. Say that again. Mr. <laughs> so you must know is fortune cookie. Oh. Never shirk a tackle. And do not shirk a fucking tackle. Check this out. Panda Express. First PA. I'd have this every day. No hesitation. So we're in PE, Panda Express. Best place ever to eat. I love it. 
I'm gonna, uh, we're a bit tired because what a first day, but I'm gonna ask some questions and you can ask the same ones to me, all right? Shane, what are your first impressions on Canadian players? I feel like they're very similar to American, yeah. in my opinion. Um, like, all can run, like athletic, but the big thing is straight away, they all just like to dribble straight away uh, when they get the ball. Yeah. Same as American. Um, but attitude spot on, energy yeah. spot on, and uh, willing like to learn to be brilliant. Yeah, nice but that's, that's, that's key, key to have that. What do you think? Yeah, very similar. I felt like it is very similar to America. Um, similar to what Jay said, I think they I don't know whether it's because they're nervous because they're not seals, but they're a bit quiet at first. Like it's really hard to get the, the personality out in them. Yeah. And I don't know whether that's because they don't know anyone, so they feel like, I feel like a lot of young players these days, they, they care too much about what people think, so they won't say anything. Um, like at the start of the drill, do you remember when we were getting them to use their voice and stuff? Yeah. Like that was the energy that we wanted. Um, yeah, very similar to America, great attitude, great energy, very good dribblers. Although I, I do think they were okay at passing in first touch. I'd say they were slightly yeah, yeah. better, but that all depends what level of player we're working with. But I thought the facility, the indoor dome was a joke. Amazing. Unbelievable. Like, I tried booting a ball to the roof and I couldn't get it. So the facility top notch, the game awareness boys, to be fair, they, they went above and beyond to help us out. It was just, in terms of day one of camps, that was right up there with one of the most chaotic, busy, busy, like so many players, so many parents, but it, because there was someone on the field before and after, it made it like even more mental. Yeah, yeah. But overall, the parents were buzzing at the end, so I think it was a great day. Uh, what do you think, Jay, the man behind the lens? That I was saying. But it was really interesting talking to a lot of the parents, because I actually think I could compare a lot of the players today and the, the football to Australia. I think there seems to be a lot of emphasis on athleticism here, um, which catches up to the players in later years. I think that's similar to Australia. Technical ability gets slept on a little bit if you're yeah, yeah, small yeah. or nippy, but that's my opinion. But yeah, everyone was lovely. Like Everyone was so gassed to have you guys here as well. Give me three players that stuck out for you today. Because we always remember the good players, don't we? Vinny. Vinny Calgaron. Yeah. Very good. Sawyer. Very good. Very, very good. And probably Vienna. Yeah, Vienna was good yeah. as well. Very much. Jay? I'd say Sawyer's number one. Number one draft pick. I think, yeah, I think she was elite. I'm going to go for a younger group player as well. His name was Samir. Younger, younger kid. Yeah, I remember. Really quiet, really timid. But... He could play. He could play. I gotta go with my boy, my boy JJ, Josiah. Yeah, just cause yeah, uh, great name. That, he was a, he was a good player. Cri well. Christopher, left four. <laughs> yeah, 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 good player. player. Very big player. Got mine. Um, lots of good players, if I'm being honest. Uh, technically, straight away Sawyer was like, see, the small technical players for me are like. They, they need to be looked after, man. But not only that, I was like, right, I can see that she's technically good. Let's see what she's like in the game. You didn't go down the bottom group. She was good. She was so good. Getting on it, half turn, wanting the ball all the time. And I was like, right, she's a, she's a player. But there was one player in the middle group, the middle game chain that you went into. I was calling him Bryson DeChambeau. Uh, he was good. Who was the banter in that middle group? He was good as well. Very good. Yeah. There was a kid in green. I forgot your pitch. name. If you're watching this and you, you were wearing the green bib in the middle pitch, this is day one. I'll know your name tomorrow. He was good. But Bryson was very, very good. Yeah, the shambo. Good very, the Good at like, he was breezing past players in that middle one. And then my final pick, is it Ishan in the bot, lower, the lower? Ishan, yeah. Yeah, he was good. Big, big fan of him. Very good in the, in the 1v1s. And I really like the, uh, is it Vivian? No, what's her name? Vienna, 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 Vienna. Yeah, yeah. Vienna Calca Caron as well, Calca Caron. I was a big fan of JJ in the one we won. Today was chaotic, so I reckon we'll be able to really have a good look tomorrow. Yeah. And in the next few days. We'll check back.
Oh, we're going basketball tomorrow. Yeah, we're going b-ball tomorrow. Listen, most of you don't like the vlogs. Guess what? Couldn't give a shit. <laughs> don't care. I feel way more prepared today. Like, by this time yesterday, there was about 400 parents and players. Once we get day one out of the way, we look, we'll be prepared today. We've got water, G pros, GoPros, Derek the drone. <laughs> We're set, I'm ready to go. I want to give a shout out to Inter Milan Academy and in particular their staff. Um, they have been excellent to us in terms of allowing us to get on the field. I think they've been finishing five minutes early so we can get on and set up. Because in, in Toronto here, there's not a chance you can do any outdoor training because it's about that high in snow. So everyone's obviously training indoors. So they've been amazing to us guys, very welcoming. They've even offered us some coffee, didn't they? Yeah. Like my personal opinion guys, that just doesn't, that doesn't happen in Australia. Like no one works together. We all just hammer each other. Well, we don't hammer other people, they hammer us. But anyway, it's very true. Facts, facts. We just stay in our lane and people hammer us. But yeah, it's but, been uh, amazing by them guys. Really Inter Milan awesome. guys have been great. Man. But we'll definitely take them up on the coffees today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yesterday we forgot. So today we've got. We've got. Uh, listen, guys, kids, don't copy our diet. But when we're coaching, we need sugar. <laughs> All right. <laughs> right. So just like. Just like yeah, but we've got it hidden. <laughs> Where's the twizzle? Yeah, no. Julesy, if Jules you're watching, yeah. you, know, you know about the twizzle. <laughs> Jules, we miss you, bro, twizzlers. <laughs> but um, players are signed to arrive. Got some really good stuff planned today. Yesterday was class. Let's see what type of energy the kids come with today. Day two's in the books. <coughs> in the car, where are we going today? JJ? We're going to Mrs. Come on, Raptors. Mrs. Sauger Stadium to pick up my <laughs> fucking tonsil. <laughs> um, I'm gonna go and see the Nuggets. Ben Nuggets. Raptors, we're gonna see the Raptors. Against Shane, I've got one question for you. Yeah. Got one question. Is Drizzy Drake gonna be there? I don't know. But I think he does be normally at all the big games, yeah. Yeah, but this is a big game, no? Yeah, yeah, they need a win. We're going to the Nuggets versus the Raptors. Drake's got us VIP tickets yeah. right at the front. Scotiabank Arena. Scotiabank, and Shane wants a big, fat hot dog. Fat hot dog. Jay, this is your first b-ball game? Yeah, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Sugar, Have sugar. Have you been to any American sports before? I've never been to America before. Oh, that's Canada. true. It's very high. Sugar, so, so yeah. you're gonna witness the Let's go Raptors defense. Yeah. Dun, dun, dun. Cause <laughs> see, for me, I don't know much about basketball, but the way Americans, well, it's not, it was in Canada, but yeah. the way they hype up the sports is just the best. Yeah. Like, I'm gonna enjoy this regardless. Stay tuned for the footage, guys, it's gonna be lit. Boys, cheers, fellas. Keep on, hold on the plate. Timmy Orton's put that in the bin. Terrible. Worst coffee ever. He just told us that we're not getting PE tonight. <laughs> he, said, he said that yesterday. And we had the we probably had the biggest bed we've ever had. Yeah. Where's Pablo? It's happened again. <laughs> <laughs> 